Hey friends, welcome to the YouTube channel all about electronics. So in this question, we have been given the boolean function which consists of four variables that is a1, a0 and b1, b0. So as you can see, these four variables represents the two unsigned binary numbers. And the output of the boolean function f is equal to 1 when the number a is greater than b. And otherwise, the output f is equal to 0. So here, we have been asked to find the minimized boolean expression of the given function. So to find the minimized expression, first of all, let us see the truth table of the given boolean function. And here, for the four different variables, we have total 16 different input combinations. So here, this a1, a0 corresponds to number a, while this b1, b0 corresponds to number b. And the output of the boolean function is equal to 1 when this a is greater than b. Or in other words, when this a1 a0 is greater than b1 b0. So as you can see, for the six different input combinations, the output of the function f is equal to 1. So as you can see, in one case, this a1 a0 is equal to 0 1, while the b1 b0 is equal to 0 0. That means in this case, this a is greater than b. Likewise, in the next two cases, this a1 a0 is equal to 1 0, while the b1 b0 is 0 0 and 0 1. That means in this case also, this a is greater than b. And likewise, in these three cases, this a1 a0 is equal to 1 1, while the b1 b0 is equal to 0 0, 0 1 and 1 0. That means in these three cases also, this a1 a0 is greater than b1 b0. That means for the six different input combinations, this number a is greater than b. So now, to find the minimized boolean expression, let us represent this function in the form of k map. And for that, first of all, let us represent each combination with the corresponding mean term. So as you can see, the output f is equal to 1 for the mean terms 4, 8, 9, as well as 12, 13, and 14. So now, let us represent these six mean terms with 1 in the k map. And with the help of the k map, let us try to find the minimal expression. So as you can see over here, we can make the group of these four ones. That is the mean term 12, 13 and the mean term 8 and 9. Similarly, here we can also make the group of this mean term 4 and 12. And likewise, we can also make the group of this mean term 12 and 14. So in this way, by making the three groups, we can cover all the ones in the K map. So here, this group of 4 is equivalent to the a1 dot b1 bar. Because in this group, this variable a is equal to 1, while the variable b1 is equal to 0. That means this group corresponds to a1 dot b1 bar. Likewise, this second group corresponds to a0 dot b1 bar dot b0 bar. Because in this group, if you see, then the value of a0 is equal to 1, while the value of b1 and b0 is equal to 0. That means this group corresponds to a0 dot b1 bar dot b0 bar. And likewise, this third group corresponds to a1 dot a0 dot b0 bar because in this group the value of b0 is equal to 0 while the value of a1 and a0 is equal to 1 1. That means this group corresponds to a1 dot a0 dot b0 bar. And if we see the overall minimized expression then that is the summation of all these groups. That means f is equal to a1 dot b1 bar plus a1 dot a0 dot b0 bar plus a0 dot b1 bar dot b0 bar. So that is the minimized expression for the given boolean function. And from this we can say that for the given question, this b is the correct answer.